Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my video today. Welcome if you are new and welcome back if you're returning. In today's video, I'm going to be cash stuffing my community savings challenge as well as doing a quick battle of the boxes. So if you're interested in seeing either of those, please be sure to stay tuned. All right, you guys, thank you again for tuning in. Like I said in the intro, my name is Brandy and this is the Brandy Janae channel. So if you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. I truly appreciate you for being here and hope that you will consider subscribing and sticking around for a while so that you can enjoy some of the fun. Now, I do have my community savings challenge here. This is from Donna over at Donna Powered by Creativity. I did miss a week of cash stuffing. So instead of the regular $18 that I have, I do have 36. So instead of doing um, $2 at a time, we're going to do, I think four should be okay. So we have give generously, holiday, debt, self-care, emergency, which I call abundance, oh poop, and that is it for this. So. If you would like more information about this challenge, definitely go check out Donna Powered by Creativity, where she has all the actual information in regards to this, along with the playlist and everything that, you know, goes along with this challenge. I'm just doing it adjacent to everyone else, so not really following along. Okay, so quick pause, because I forgot to read the quote for today. First of all, happy September. Yay, it's September 1st. So happy September to all of you. I hope this month brings you joy and peace and all of the blessings that are allotted to you according to God's purpose in your life. September 1st says, use your home as a gathering place. You can use it to give back by having a dinner party and asking others to bring a can of food or to donate something. Additionally, use it to create a space to give back to loved ones around the table, fill their plates while also filling up their souls. I love this. This is so, so nice. Like, I don't have a house <laughs> necessarily to have as a gathering place, um, but I do love the idea. So if you do have a home that you can invite other people into, I think that is a wonderful idea and a wonderful tradition to start for your family. So anyway, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to roll my dice here. Um, Let's use this one because that one's pretty. And number six is first. One, two, three, four. Number five. One. Four. Come on, three. Ooh. Four again, three, five, one, two or three. <laughs> All right, three. And last roll, number six. All right, so oh poop got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Awesome. And then abundance got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And self care one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Deck got four. Holidays did not get anything. And Give Generously got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, so I am all caught up on that, which makes me very happy. Now for my boxes. Oh, I'm actually going to put the boxes money back here. So actually, I need to take this out. 
So for the boxes challenges, I did decide to go ahead and take out all of the money from all of the boxes and put them in one stack because it's just easier. And then that way, all I have to use is prop money for the actual challenges and I don't have to like switch back and forth. So this money here though, I forgot to take out. It actually needs to go into my um, completed challenges for the month of August because I am trying to do a better job at making sure that, you know, I'm doing just, I just kind of want to keep a better track of what I'm saving monthly so I can see which months are like really good and which months are not so great. I have a feeling that September is going to be one of those not so great months <laughs> just because I, in case you're new here, I did just recently go and buy my dream car, which was the Tesla Model 3 which means that my car payment is going to be higher than it previously was. Um, so I'm going to have to like really adjust my budget a bit, which I'm okay with. I have literally waited 12 years to get this car. So I'm super excited that I was finally placed in a position to be able to do so. But like I said, with that, it is going to change my budget a bit. Um, but that's okay. We're gonna, we're gonna work with it and we're gonna save what we can and keep moving like we've been moving. So I have a hundred dollars here that I'm going to use for my box challenges. So we will put that in there. I have a dashboard, but I don't know where I put it. So boom, boom, right now that's going to be that I'll find it eventually. Okay. So then this binder is done. Now, with that $100, we are going to use our prop money. So let's do oh, um, this is from uh, Chaos and Budgets. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Forty two, four, six, eight, fifty two, four, six, eight, and sixty. Let's see what do we have left in one sixty one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventy. We'll actually take one of these twos out and put these two ones in. All right, so that was 70, 80, 90, and 100. And I am going to make sure. <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 70, Two, four, six, eight, eighty, two, four, six, eighty eight, eighty nine, ninety, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one hundred. All right. So another change that I made with the boxes is I'm not doing all eight boxes at the same time. We're going to do four for the month of September, and then we'll do another four for October and so on and so forth, just because the eight for me was like very overwhelming. And I would like to actually finish some of them. So um, we have the coffee box, and this is from Maria over at She's Got It. We will be doing the monthly box in every single rotation. Um, this is the calendar box, and this is from I'll Always Save. So this will be in every rotation. And we have the donut box, which is from my Etsy shop. And um, next month, I will switch this to my stitches box, which is also in my Etsy shop. And then we have the mall box, which is from Prop Budgets. And um, yeah, so these are the four we'll be working with. This month, I did put the spooky box and then the stitches box. I'm going to do those in October because I felt they were more like Halloween-like. So that's why I switched those over. So here are the cards. We will start with the coffee box. And I am going to pull, let's start with three cards. Okay, so we have Vietnam. 
And I put mine in alphabetical order. I did not follow the um, the uh, tracker thing. Okay, so this is, oh good, this is the last one on this one. So this is $4, two and four. Okay, so let's put those two back and get a five. Okay, so this one is the $27 saved, which is awesome. So now this one will come up to the front and this one will go to the back. Okay, then we have Columbia, which is here. So we have another four dollars, two and four. This one saved thirty-five. So again, we'll put these two and grab a five. So that's exciting. Another one. All right, and then last we have Brazil. Oh, good. And this is the last one of this one. Yay. All right. So $5 in here. And this one also saved. Hmm. Oh, no, there's another one. Okay. I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> okay. There's one more on there. I see. All right. So coffee binder is done. All right, so we're gonna do the same thing for the monthly binder. Let's go ahead and grab, I'm gonna sit down now. I was checking to see if my, making sure my camera was going to stay filming, but we're just gonna trust it. <laughs> One, two, and three. All right, the first one is save $6. So that looks like in October. Are writing the amounts on these? Yes. Okay. So this one gets six dollars. Okay. Ooh. December roll of dice. Six. And that is an ugly sweater. <laughs> All right. And oh, back to October. Eleven dollars. Sheesh. Mm. That one is spicy. All right, trick or treat. Here is ten and one for eleven. Let's put those back and grab a two. monthly box done for now we will come back to it if we can all right let's go to the donut box one two and three. First card mm -mm. yum 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 i thought i wrote on these i guess i didn't and i do a roll and save for my donut box so you can either do a roll and save or you can choose a denomination, it's completely up to you. So I got a six. Six is like the number of the day, apparently. Let's see. So now it has 12. Let's put those two back. Grab a two. Put 
those two back and grab a 10. Okay, this one. Oh, fives are fun. So that is this one. Roll the dice to add some spice if you dare. Ah, okay, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> ah, four to $20. <laughs> One, two, three, and four. Oh my goodness. All right, so 10, 15, and $20 in this one. All right, and then this will have to go back into the active deck so that you can use it again because there's only one of those. All right, whew. Then we have a regular blue sprinkly one. That's this one here. Three. All right. So two and one make three all right don't oh these two okay so these are the cards i used these are the ones i have not used i'm gonna shuffle those back up so that i don't forget okay and pop those in okay and last for this round is going to be the mall. Um, where are my mall cards? I just remember they're in a totally different box. Oh, here they are. Okay, so for the mall cards, we have our sales. And we have our stores. So one, two, three. Those are the stores we're going to today. So bookstore. Toy store and grocery store. All right, and these are our, I don't know. I don't know which ones I've already used. Okay, these are the ones I've already used. So these are the ones I have not used. Okay. Oh, it goes this way. Okay. Woo! Sorry, guys. <laughs> the mall is a lot. All right. So let's pick one of each. Okay, so we have the encyclopedia from the bookstore, we have a yo-yo from the toy store, and we have bananas from the grocery store. Taxes on the banana, $2. Taxes on the yo-yo, $3. And taxes on the book encyclopedias, $5. Sheesh. All right, let's roll and see if I can get a discount here. I think you need an 
even? Is it an even number for a discount? Yes. Okay, yes, even. Okay, so I got a six. So this one gets, well, save $6. That doesn't help me. So we don't, we can't use that one. We can use it at the bookstore though. Let's roll again. Odd, nope. And a six again. Save $3 we can use here. Okay. All right, guys. So this is not at all how this is supposed to go for the record. <laughs> just trying to get some stuff done so at the bookstore today it was five six seven eight but i get to save six dollars so the bookstore is getting two dollars today i should have just picked one store and did three cards from that one store but that's okay Oh, I put that in the wrong spot. That goes here. Okay. So the bookstore is done. All right, now let's go to the grocery store. And I have to pay $4 at the grocery store. Two and four. Okay. So that one is done. And then last but not least, we go to the toy store. And the toy store is $4, save $3, so $1 at the toy store. All right, there we go. What is this? Oh, taxes. Okay, so we're gonna put these back. And I think these other ones, I'm just going to start like a regular just like discard box. And then I'll just, um, <laughs> I'll just separate them all out later because that's going to be really hard to keep track of which ones are which. Okay, so these are all my sales. All right. So we'll put those to the side and these are the sales cards which I need to find another rubber band for. Okay, Whew. let's go. Four-sided die that I created myself. I have one, but I don't like it. The, I have one, but I, I don't like the four-sided die. Blank, which means it's my pick. So we're gonna go to the donut. I am going to pick one yellow with sprinkles. We got one, boo. Let's roll again. Three. Oh, huh. donut box. <laughs> Ooh, this one is a little extra because I took a bite out of it. So you got hungry times two. So three times two would be six. Mm, mm, mm. If you get the heart one, then you multiply your number times three. So that goes in there. All right, binder number three, back in place. Let's roll again. Blank, uh, let's do coffee. Okay. 
Kenya. This one is another $4. Oh, good. And this is the last one on this one. Two and four. And this one should be a saved 30. So two, four, one is five, and that makes 30. And then we're going to move this one to the front and this one to the back. Sweet. All right, this is back in number one spot. Let's roll again. Blank. Uh, let's do the monthly. I keep calling it the monthly, but it's the calendar box. <laughs> It is the calendar box. Um, where am I? Cal oh, here we are. Oh, was that October? Maybe. Yep. October has been on fire today. Roll a dice and double it. Three. So that would be six dollars for this one. Two, four, six. Yeah, October is. Mm. Two, four, two, four, six, eight. Let me, I'm going to see if I can, um, let me get some change for this. So one, two, so two, four, five, and five makes ten. I like to condense as much as possible because obviously I need the smaller bills more than the bigger ones. All right, there we go. And since I have money in so many binders, my smaller bills are stretched thin. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four. Let's put this one back. And we got a little money left. Number one, which is coffee, Brazil, seven. Oh, good. This is the last one for this one. I'm excited to be able to start two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're going to trade these for a five. Oh, but I was saying I'm excited to be able to um, finish this one so I can start on the scratch off cards. So this is take those back and get a 10. 35. All right. So we're going to move this one up and this one back. And ugh, one, two, three. <sighs> I'm scared. I don't want to risk it. <laughs> okay, two is the monthly or calendar box. Oh man, please be low. Yes, four dollars. Oh, that worked out perfectly. Because that's exactly what I have. One, two, three, four. Yay! All right, and we're going to take this $6 and trade it also for a 10. Ah, oh, guys, that worked out perfectly. Okay. Yay! All right, and just in case you thought I forgot, I did it. <laughs> So let's go back here. We finished one, two, three, and four challenges today. So ding, 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 ding. <laughs> and I'm gonna put the $4 
one, two, three, four in my completed challenges envelope. And this is also from Donna Powered by Creativity. So definitely go check this out. It is a freebie on her page. And every time we finish a challenge, we are stuffing a dollar in here just to see how many challenges we can finish for, for me, it'll be for the year. So this isn't really accurate because sometimes I do actually forget, but it's, you know, pretty close and just another way to save. So anyway, you guys, that is it. I know this video was long. I appreciate you for sticking with me till the end. If you did stick with me to the end, please leave me a blue heart emoji. You guys are amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet and be well. And I'll catch you in the next one.